guys, welcome back to Do It At A Dime. You are gonna love these gorgeous organizers and you're gonna love even more that they're so easy to make, like anybody can do it. First, we're making gorgeous Dollar Tree fabric organizers. So the Dollar Tree sells these little mini rugs and placemats that come in all different sizes. You can also go to the dollar section at Target and get these little mini rugs. They're just a couple of dollars. And again, really sturdy fabric with these really cute tassels. And this could not be easier because all you need is some hot glue. Lay your mat down pretty side up and then turn the edge over so your tassel lays over it. And you can experiment with how far you want this to go down the side of your container. Then you're gonna add some hot glue to the outer edges, then fold the mat over itself, and then you're gonna glue the project together. Put hot glue two thirds of the way down the mat, leaving the remaining portion open. This is the really cool part I saw on Instagram. Somebody was doing an Ikea hack with this and I absolutely loved it. I'll be sure to link it down below. And this is gonna create a really beautiful seam for your bag. Do that to both sides and then you're gonna turn your bag right side out. And here's the same steps with the Dollar Tree placemat. You have the edges turned over, fold the project on itself, and add your hot glue. And if you didn't know, they actually sell fabric glue, which is so awesome, especially if you don't love sewing. I'm using hot glue in this video, but you can use either one. I will be sure to link it down below. Any type of sturdy fabric works great for this. These Dollar Tree placemats are another great option. They come in so many different colors. And you can also experiment with the placement of your tassel down the bag. My favorite way to use these are to store towels and bathrooms. You'll have to let me know yours in the comments below. So next we're making oversized bins using Dollar Tree's nautical rope. They also have the really thick jute twine, and yes, I have this much just sitting in my stash. I love the Dollar Tree metal organizers. They are so quality, and this nautical rope is too. Put it through the side of your container halfway, and then you're only working with half of the rope at a time, and weave it through in and out. Turn on your favorite Netflix show, sit down and enjoy. This really only takes a couple of minutes to complete. Once you've finished the other side, you can secure this easily with zip ties. I cut off the edges and add it on. And what I love about this is the bottom is open. It makes it really easy to clean up, but it looks so elegant in a bathroom. I love this one so much and it just costs $2. You guys know how much I love the locker bins at Dollar Tree, and that's what we're working with next, as well as some jute twine. Now you may remember I did this a couple of years ago on my channel, but they have thicker jute twine at Dollar Tree now, and these locker bins are the best way to use this. You don't even have to add hot glue to each side. I usually do one side of hot glue and then a couple of wraparounds. You can also find pillowcases at the Dollar Tree, and that way you don't have to line this all the way to the top. Just set your pillowcase right inside. This is a beautiful bread basket or storage for books or toys for your kids. If you enjoyed this video and want more like it, you leave it a big thumbs up and a comment down below really helps me out a lot. If nobody has told you today, you are enough. Go make something awesome. You deserve it. I can't wait to catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe so I don't miss ya and I'll see you there. Bye. This is one of our favorites. You can set out all the books you want to read during the week. Should we read that one? Sometimes it just takes I should also probably do our laundry instead of making organizing containers. <laughs> <laughs>